everyone, Liz Leanne here and I'm back again with another grocery haul. So this is just a look at everything that I've got today and this is from Ocado. Right, I'll just get straight in and uh, just show you everything that I've got. I'm going to start with the water. So this water is the um, the sparkling water, and this was reduced from one seventy five to one pound for a bottle, which I thought was really good. It's seven hundred and fifty mils, and normally this is like an expensive, isn't it? By one seventy five, I guess, isn't. Well, I don't know if that's really, really expensive for this particular water, but in my mind it is. But with it being a pound, I thought I'd give it a go. And I really like to have a bit of squash with fizzy water in it. So I've got two new bottles of squash over there. Um, I'll get to those in a minute. But yeah, this is the, as I say, I went for 10 of these. And they're in the nice glass bottles as well. Ooh, that makes me feel a bit posh. Um, bananas, I needed some bananas. So I've got the ripen at home ones. Uh, let's move that up a bit. Potatoes, I've got some um, of the white potatoes. I think that's two, yeah, two kilogram of white potatoes. Some yogurt. So the fat-free yogurt. And then I went for three of these fish cakes. Um, so you've got the two battered cod and crushed pea fish cakes i haven't had these before but i mean they just really appealed to me i mean we do like a fish cake and the fact that the peas are on top of the cod it just just gave me the like fish and chip shop vibes so you've got three of those let's move it over here um so marks and spencer's greek salad cheese a pack of the low fat pork sausages um cold meats i went for um one of these which is the um the roast pork so there's 10 slices there are only tiddly widdly ones though um but yeah i've just got to think about pork at the minute then a pack of 15 slices of the cooked ham um onions so i've got a pack of the three red onions Needed some more kitchen rolls, so I've got that pack of plenty. Uh, milk, so I've got, I think this is four pints of the skimmed um, milk, the Bob one. Although it's skimmed, it tastes like semi-skimmed and it does last so, so much longer. So eggs, I've got one and a half dozen of these eggs. And they have really lovely yolks in. So, yeah, these are the six. Uh, so, it's half a dozen of the Bertha Brown's free range eggs. Um, and as I say, I've got one and a half dozen of those. Uh, toilet roll. I ordered this toilet roll, which is the Ocado one. You've got nine rolls in there. And then baked beans. So, I've got a pack of four cans of the Branston baked beans. We're really enjoying those at the moment. Right, let's go around this side. Um, okay, squash. So I went for this one. This is the Robinson's Fruit Creation Tangy Apple and Rhubarb. I thought that's, that's going to be nice. And then this one, this is the Vimto and it's an added sugar and it's blood orange with a citrus taste. I thought those a go. Loaves, I just got a couple of the Warburton's um, Danish loaves, the wholemeal ones. Um, tomatoes, a pack of six salad tomatoes, some grapes, some nectarines and two packs of strawberries. And that's everything that we needed this week. Um, I will pop the price on the screen. 
But uh, yeah, it wasn't a massive shop. But uh, as I say, it is literally everything that we needed. So see you in the next shopping haul. Bye for now. Yeah. Hi guys. So future editing Leslie Ann here. Um, I thought I'd include this Iceland haul that's arrived today because the other one wasn't very big. I've like tagged on the following weeks. So let me go back and show you. I've done an uh, Iceland haul. I've got some more bags over there. So I will take everything out and show you what I've got. Okie dokie then, so this is the frozen stuff that I've got this week. Um, I've totally, totally stocked up on um, a fair few convenience bits and ice lollies and ice creams. Of course, here in the UK it is the six week school holiday and um, grandchildren are eating ice lollies etc. And so are we, to be honest. Not quite as much as the grandkids, though. Um, so, yeah, they're coming around, and so I've stocked up. This will not do six weeks, but it will do a while. Um, because here in the south coast of the UK, where we live, uh, currently today it's 30 degrees, so it's really warm. Um, anyway, let me talk you through what I've got. So I've got here some of the chicken breast strip hot and spicy um, fillets. Yeah, one of my grandsons is only nine, but he loves hot and spicy stuff. And then some chicken breast fillets. These are the sweet chili ones. Ice lollies and ice creams. Let me do those and they can go straight into the freezer. So two, I've got two boxes of the uh, candy coated cones. They're Iceland's own. And then a pack of the J2O fruit blended ice creams, orange and passion fruit. So like the same flavour as you get the, you know, the drinks and the bottles. Um, twisters, I've got three packs of twisters, as you can see. Um, this one is the Berrylicious one, uh, four in a box. And actually calorie wise, they're not bad at all. They've got the calories on. Um, these are 68 and these are 65. So these are the um, fruit zinger ones. So two boxes of those. A box of the Tango Dark, Dark Berry Sub Zero Tang. Um, over this way, let me see if I can get that a little bit easier. Um, one of the bubblegum swell lollies and two boxes of the Chewix Extreme Sour Lollies. So you've got sour apple, sour cherry, sour lemon. Um, then over there, I've got a bag of uh, frozen, frozen Richmond sausages. So you've got eight pork sausages in there. Here actually, I've got some more water. So I've got four packs of the water. Um, so this is the Nestle Pure Life ones and you get 12 in a pack. And so I've got four of those there look, so that we can put those in the drinks fridge. Um, crinkle cut chips, so one and 1.25 kilograms, they're Iceland's own chips. Um, a bag of the Aunt Bessie's proper good large Yorkshire puddings. I mean, who's going to be making their own Yorkshires in this weather? Certainly not me. And then last but not least of all the frozen stuff, um, some of these Grill House barbecue pork ribs so there we go 600 grams in there so right need to get to these to the freezer now my loves drinks i've got this is new to me i haven't seen this before and this is tango cherry sugar free so you get eight cans 330 mils each so i've gone for two of those that's the first one and there's the second one there look right and the last little bits of pantry stuff that i I actually got this shop, didn't need like, I mean, I've got some meat dishes over there really to use, but I've still got stuff in the fridge and the freezer. Um, but I got these, these Weight Watchers white tortillas. Um, I think I've only had these once before. And yeah, they look a reasonable size. I mean, if they're too big, I don't eat them. So yeah, let's uh, give those a whirl. 
um, some John West tuna fish. So this is in spring water. So a pack of those is four there. Some Heinz Classic Barbecue Smoky and Rich Sauce. Then I also got some of the Daddy's sauce, the Daddy's Brown sauce. Mushrooms, I got a pan of mushrooms. Cheese wise, these were, I think these were two for 4 50 um, So the grated red Leicester and then the grated mature cheddar and then little treats. Well, the lot is treats, I know, but like, you know. Jamaica ginger cake by McVitie's, and this is a sticky pudding one. So with this one, you can heat it up if you want to, and it goes like all sticky on the top, and you can have it with ice cream or whatever. Um, in the winter, you can have it with custard or cream, or you could have it like with that now if you like, but it's a bit too warm outside well, where we are anyway. Um, Turkish July, got two of these. These are the orange flavour, so two packs of those. And then last but not least, a pack of strawberry dime. And these are absolutely delicious. If you haven't tried them, I would recommend them highly. Um, that's it. That's everything that I got this week. I'll pop the price on the screen as I have done with the previous shop in this video and I'll talk to you later everyone. I'd really appreciate it if you like this video. If you would just give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel by pressing that bell there. And then if you press the notification bell by pressing yet another bell there. You'll know when I've done my next upload. Look after yourselves, everyone. I'll see you in the next video. Talk to you soon. Bye.